Dear friends, in this tutorial, we will learn about Zener diode and its working principle. We have already discussed the Zener region of a diode in previous lecture. Please follow the link in the description. These are the points discussed in this tutorial. A Zener diode allows the flow of current from anode to cathode as well as in reverse direction when the Zener voltage is reached. The device was named under Clarence Melvin Zener, who discovered the Zener effect. Both the semiconductor diode and Zener diode symbols are as shown in this figure. Let us start with its operation. In a conventional diode, when the reverse bias voltage exceeds the reverse breakdown voltage, a high current flows through the diode, because of avalanche breakdown. If this current is not limited by the circuitry, this high current will damage the diode permanently due to overheating. But, in the case of Zener diode, the device is specially designed so as to have reduced breakdown voltage in contrast to a conventional diode. Zener diode exhibits control breakdown and allows current to keep the voltage across the Zener diode close to the Zener breakdown voltage. The location of the Zener region depends on the doping levels. An increase in doping concentration results in decrease in Zener potential. Practical Zener diodes have Zener potential in the range of 1.8 volt to 200 volt with a power rating of 0.25 watt to 50 watt because of its higher temperature capability. So, silicon is more preferred in the manufacture of Zener diodes. The complete equivalent circuit of the Zener diode in the Zener region includes a small dynamic resistance RD and a DC battery equal to the Zener potential as shown in this figure, 10.3. For all the applications, the external resistors are assumed much larger in magnitude than the Zener resistor. Figure 10.3b shows the equivalent circuit may be assumed to be only a voltage, that is, VZ. Now, let us learn the construction of Zener diode. The Zener diode operation depends on the heavy doping of its PN junction. The depletion region thus formed is very thin, of the order of less than 1 micrometer. This will result in small reverse bias voltage of about 3 volt or 5 volt, allowing electrons to tunnel from the valence band of the p-type material to the conduction band of the n-type material. At the atomic stage, this tunneling corresponds to the transport of valence electron into the empty conduction band that the breakdown voltage can be controlled quite accurately with the doping process. The tolerance is in the range of 5 to 10 percent. Now, we will consider the temperature effects. The temperature coefficient of Zener diode reflects the percentage change in Zener potential, delta Vz, versus its temperature. It is defined by the equation 10.1, where, delta Vz, is the resulting change in Zener potential due to temperature variation. T0, is the temperature, at which Vz is provided, generally 25 degrees Celsius. D1 is the new level of temperature. This figure shows the temperature effects, that is, change in temperature with current. Thank you for watching the video. If you find it beneficial, please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. I would also like to have comments if further modification is required.